A narcissistic mother can have a lasting effect on her daughter's life, leading to difficulties forming healthy relationships with others, low self-esteem, and an increased likelihood of developing the same traits as her mother. However the question is do daughters of narcissistic mothers become narcissists themselves? The answer to this question is complicated. While it is true that daughters of narcissistic mothers are more likely to develop narcissistic traits than those whose mothers are not narcissists, it is not inevitable. Recent research has shed light on this topic and revealed that while some traits may be genetic, it is not a given that daughters of narcissistic mothers will become narcissists. In fact, it has been found that children are often quite resilient, and that many daughters of narcissistic mothers are so appalled by their parents' behavior that they go out of their way to avoid becoming like their mother when they grow up. It is important to note, however, that even if a daughter does not become a narcissist herself she is still bound to struggle with the effects of growing up in such an environment. Narcissistic mothers are emotionally abusive towards their daughters. While some regularly belittle or berate their daughters for not meeting their impossible expectations, others employ gaslighting and emotional manipulation as tools for control. Narcissistic mothers often try to control their daughters' lives, from what she wears and how she acts to who she befriends and where she goes. A narcissist may frequently pit her children against one another or outright lie in order to maintain control or manipulate her child into doing something she wants. Narcissistic mothers often assault their daughters verbally. They will belittle and berate them, punishing them for things that are not their fault. In addition, they subject their children to constant criticism, forcing them to strive for an unattainable level of perfection. A narcissistic mother will also use psychological manipulation techniques such as gaslighting to confuse her daughter, causing the child to doubt her own memory, perception, and even sanity. And finally, narcissistic mothers will rarely allow their daughters to have any boundaries. They view any limits as an affront to their power and authority over their children, because they do not view them as individuals with rights of their own. Narcissistic mothers can have a profound and long-lasting impact on their daughter's sense of self-worth, emotional stability, and relationships. The effects of an emotionally abusive upbringing caused by a narcissistic parent can be pervasive, with daughters often struggling to overcome feelings of guilt, shame, insecurity and fear. It is well known that narcissistic personality disorder is linked to genetics, meaning that the children of a narcissist are more likely to develop this disorder themselves. Research shows that having a parent with narcissistic personality disorder increases one's risk of developing the disorder by up to six times. Additionally, a study conducted in 2012 found that as many as 75% of people with narcissistic personality disorder reported having at least one parent who also had the disorder. Therefore, genetically there is indeed a case to say that there is a higher risk that daughters of narcissistic mothers become narcissists themselves. It is thus important that they are aware of their heightened risk and take measures to reduce the potential for the disorder to manifest in any way. In conclusion, while daughters of narcissistic mothers are more likely than those raised by non-narcissistic parents to develop similar traits themselves, it isn't an inevitability. It is in fact possible for them to lead happy lives without succumbing to similar behaviors, as long as they work through any unresolved issues from childhood using therapeutic methods such as counseling or coaching. Moreover, these same women can use what they've learned from growing up in such an environment, such as resilience and strength, to help them create better lives for themselves going forward. For more information about narcissists and narcissistic abuse, visit www.carlacorelli.com.